with Hudson White, we decided that it, it, it wasn't really necessary to have two different variations. So, so some brands have a coastal range and an offshore range. Um, we just have one range because actually it doesn't matter whether you're crossing the Solent, crossing the Bay of Biscay or cruising um, in, in warmer climates. You just want something that works really well. If you're caught out in bad weather, it doesn't matter where you are, even walking down the street, you want to be kept warm and dry. Our, our approach is to have just very good gear um, for, 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 for any, any occasion. Generally, you want to have something that is waterproof, breathable, lightweight and then you can wear layers underneath when it's, when it's cooler. Well, personally, I like a, a long sleeve top, possibly something that's lightweight, dries easily, uh, and then maybe a fleece, um, uh, something like this, a, a gilet works very well, or you could have something, a, a day jacket, um, and then a waterproof, a set of waterproofs to go on, to go on top. Salopettes, and if the weather's nice, wear a pair of shorts. But uh, if, it's, if, it's, if it's starting to get uh, wet or cold, uh, a pair of salopettes um, keep, you, keep you warm and dry. And that way you've got uh, various layers that you can wear um, for whatever the weather. It doesn't really matter whether you're a, a, a fair weather cruiser or, or, or someone who's happy to go out in all conditions. The chances are you could get caught in some bad weather at, at any stage, so at any time. So it makes sense to be prepared uh, and have gear that will, will, will look after you whatever the conditions. When you're out and about, if you're sailing, um, the weather can change quite rapidly. So it can go from being really quite warm to, to, to quite cold quite quickly. Uh, so you want to be prepared for, for all, all eventualities. Wearing layers means you can take on or off the, 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 the gear as the, as the weather changes. Uh, but having something that will protect you from rain or even just spray uh, coming over the deck um, is very important. Because as soon as you get wet, you, you, you get cold and it's, it's hard to warm up again. From a sizing point of view, it's sensible to pick something that allows you to wear other layers underneath, um, that doesn't constrain you, because if, if you are working hard on the boat, hoisting sails or, or, or winding winches, um, or generally moving around, you, you don't want to be constrained, um, but you want to be warm. So um, something that's comfortable, um, something that's adjustable as well. So you can draw in the bottom or around the waist so that you're, um, you're comfortable in, 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 in all situations or, or depending on how many layers you have on underneath.